$8,000 saved. Mm. Here now is the founder and CEO of Ramsey Solutions, the financial icon himself, the master, the one and only Dave Ramsey. <laughs> Dave, good to see you. Thanks for being with us. So a, a two-part question for you. Does that number 1.46 million to retire, does that sound right to you? And if so, how does anybody get to that massive number for the retirement? Well, it, it's not enough for some, and it's way too much for others. So, you know, I don't know where that number comes from. It's something somebody just dreamed up in a poll. But obviously, where you live, how you choose to live, the standard of living you want to retire at gives you the number that you need annually. And then we can back into the size of your nest egg that you need. So for, you know, a million dollars, you know, should generate, say, 8%. That'd be $80,000 a year to live off of. If you can live comfortably off of 80000 then a million's enough. If you need 160, it sounds like you need two million. So somewhere in there, but yeah, you can do it. You just need to start saving again. The good news is, is that we have found, we did the largest study ever done of millionaires in North America. And we found that the typical millionaire in America did not inherit their money. 89% were not millionaires because of inheritance. They did it the old fashioned way, they earned it. And um, they were, the number one way they became millionaires was just simply putting money in their 401k mm. over a long period of time and getting their home paid off. It really wasn't rocket surgery. Dave, I'm gonna ask you, the Wall Street Journal wrote this piece, it was probably a month and a half ago, about Dave Ramsey tells millions what to do with their money, people under 40 say he's wrong. There's a hashtag on the TikTok, which I don't use, but it says hashtag Dave Ramsey wouldn't approve. And it's a bunch of young people <laughs> uh, who essentially um, openly f uh, flout your recommendations about living more frugally and saving. And that's, I, I'm just gonna let you respond, but I think that's gonna blow up in their face. Because once you start living high on the hog, you live that life, you wanna live that lifestyle for the rest of your life and you're not gonna have the money to do it. But what say you? Yeah. Well, I mean, anything on social media, you can find a lot of fun stuff on me. I'm, I'm real good clickbait, so <laughs> it works really good. Uh, so have at it. But yeah, and it's always been that way. I've been doing this for 35 years, and there's always a group of people who say you can't do it. Uh, and so the system has to change, and they're a victim, and they're entitled. And, you know, TikTok gives them a voice or Instagram gives them a voice or whatever, but it's always been that way. On, on talk radio, we gave them a voice. They could call in and scream at me, and it was fun. It made great radio. But the truth is, is that this Gen Z generation and the millennials who caught a bunch of crap are excellent generations. Uh, what we're seeing with both of them is there is a segment of them that is very serious and very good with their money. They believe in it. They believe in saving, they believe in investing, that they believe in the free enterprise system. And then there's a segment of them that just sucks. They're just awful. I mean, they're participation trophy, they live in their mother's basement, and they can't figure out why they can't buy a house because they don't work, you know, and stuff like that. But I've got 400 millennials, 500 millennials working on our team here at Ramsey. They're incredible. I love them. Gen Z all over the building. I love them. They're fabulous. And so it's just this one segment of whiners on TikTok or something pops up because they don't want to face the fact that they got to control the person in their mirror. So true. You know, these uh, young people that suck, they want to live and spend like they've worked and saved for 35 years, and it doesn't work that way. Dave Ramsey, always good yeah. to see you. Thanks for being with us. You can check out his virtual event. with you guys.